so uh, so first of all uh, thank you uh, actually for supporting and uh, in a sense uh, trusting and believing so many things are there uh, so uh, now it is uh, just now that uh, we have started or i have started personally uh, after my uh, after my uh, eight years or 12 nearly 12 years in civil services examination i tried for uh, as you might be aware i tried for uh, becoming a civil services officer ias or an ips so that was my dream but after that uh, 2019 was my last attempt so after that i have been uh, teaching or trying to teach or uh, trying to uh, trying to be a better mentor something like that so and anthropology happens to be one of the one of the most favorite things for me in upsc personally uh, and uh, i mean i asked see this is the point uh, many asked why uh, why in a sense uh, why uh, this is not an on or it, it is just an online uh, thing uh, the thing was that i asked for a lot of support or i asked for teaching anthropology at so many places see ananagar is not a very easy place to teach you know it's not an easy place to get an opportunity so as you are all civil services aspirant you should know that uh, opportunities are not that easy it comes very uh, after a long time of struggle uh, and i know for a fact that the upsc has taught me struggling uh, and uh, struggling or in 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 evolution we'll read that we'll we'll read for example in evolution whatever we are going to see in anthropology is up, is going to be about that how after a long struggle life blossoms so that is what we will see now and same is the case so anthropology i wanted to teach but i did not get any opportunity see that is the point uh, see this is just a stepping stone this is just a stepping stone it's very costly at ananagar i could not afford a place otherwise i would have had a place at ananagar uh, for anthropology class it was not my aim to have an online class uh, but okay uh, whatever we have see that is the point the meaning of all these things should be what what good we make out of the things that we have so i have this online platform through that i can assure you one thing uh, every everything everything as as good as it in offline everything i can assure you that that i will be able to do online i will teach or i will try to give you every possible topic in anthropology and i will give you the concepts as well and i will give you what to write as well and we will discuss questions as well whatever uh, or what to what extent uh, if it is going also i will try to complete and i will try to give you a complete picture as it is in offline okay there will not be any compromise in uh, in subject or in uh, topics or in this is just an online class no this is not an online class i wanted to have an see that is the point i wanted to meet you all people but i what opportunity i have i have to make good use of that so that is what we will see now and this is the brief introduction so that is the point so my name is sivaraj rajendran and uh, i have given this nine attempts and eight mains and uh, my graduation so this is the point my graduation is b electronics and communication so ece so this is also uh, something which i have forgotten to mention so b electronics and communication and uh, i know for a fact what the civil services is so that is what we will see and we will directly go so uh, i if for example if any of you uh, have some doubt you can put your doubts in that comment section i will read that also i'll try to clarify that also so we will give say, today what i will show you is that what is this syllabus or in a sense see uh, what you have to study in anthropology in a nice way see not in a monotonous way this is that that is that in a nice way I'll, in a story kind of way i will try to explain you what is the syllabus next i will give you this book list the simple book list for anthropology what is that uh so how you will understand these both these things so once you understand the syllabus and the book list you will be able to make sure that okay whether you will you will be able to understand whether you can uh, opt for this subject or not so it will uh, get clarified so uh, without any delay we will go to this uh, story so i'll i'll start with the syllabus what you have to read as the syllabus so this is the syllabus if you can check this but uh, this is 
kind of uh, uh, what is that uh, monotonous thing uh, what this is this is a meaning of anthropology or uh, evolution of anthropology something like that see <laughs> you don't have to remember like this i'll tell you a story you will remember it so these are the syllabus so we'll check one by one so i'll tell you one by one uh, you you also please have your syllabus if you have your syllabus in your hand you can have that so that you will be able to or just to download and have a pdf so that you will be able to understand what we are saying and whether you are liking the subject see that is the most important part of this uh, civil services examination is that optional subject should not be something which someone forces on you okay no never optional subject should always you see even if i force don't take that so you you are you are your own your own wish and you should like that subject and anthropology i really like so i'll try to see if you guys like it too so this is the point so these are the uh, topics but please have it in your hand the pdf is in uh, you can download it also or if you have it in uh, something you please check that also as we are talking so that is paper 2 or sorry paper 1 this is paper 2 okay so but uh, we'll go to the uh, that is the point instead of seeing that i'll tell you uh, the story behind that so and one uh, and uh, the first thing see the first thing is that see uh, i personally think see in anthropology you will be will be learning very deeply about what is religion what are the meaning meaning of religion rituals what is sacred why religion is so sacred all these things we will learn but uh, uh, overall understanding you should un you should know is that all these uh, the meaning of god you know meaning of so i'll start with so in cinema also they start first with this pulaya uh, rettanga odikiradha okay so i will also start with the uh, the images of god uh, not because it is uh, auspicious or something but i feel that uh, gods you know gods uh, human beings have invented as a as a reason of the philosophical questions that arose in their mind you know some questions will arise in humans mind and they will make a god out of it so gods are our philosophical reasons or our philosophical thoughts in person so every day when you see you will have so many questions in your mind all those questions you will find the answers in god so that is why gods are very important for us and every day everyone say go go worship god why because all the philosophical thoughts of our ancestors have been put into this uh, images of god but what does this uh, three or wh what do these three people convey means uh, one you will know so this is brahma okay brahma vishnu and shiva you will know this uh, one is the god of birth one is the god of sustain or how to live one is the god of death and that is what is the syllabus that is what is the syllabus of first paper so this is what we will see so what is anthropology so if you check that this is that is the three gods which i said what is anthropology if you ask me or what is anthropology or what we are going to study uh, if you ask me in a sense revolves around three questions that is the god of birth okay so first what question arose in humans mind you know so in you imagine you imagine a scenario where you are inside the forest okay where you are inside the forest thousands of years ago there is no google there is no internet there is no mobile phone nothing you are sitting in the forest and you are thinking in the, you are thinking you would think the first question you know how did we come here how we came here the isn't this the isn't this one question that everyone asks in the sense how did we come here so this is what is the first question in anthropology we will ask while studying and this is the point you will know and the story in detail i cannot tell you now but just for a, for a, for a, for your understanding that is what i said see why i love anthropology is that it teaches us perseverance it teaches us so many things how i will tell you there were uh, in a sense see you are sitting now you are sitting so how we came here it was not a easy thing 
so we assume that uh, things we uh, we get in life are so easy no it comes after a long time of struggle same is the case with evolution you are sitting here in the same place so most most of you would be in chennai or tamil nadu something like that right so the place in which we are sitting this place was occupied by someone called as the dinosaurus this same, very same place the very same place where i am sitting you go back 70 million years ago you go back 70 million years ago these dinosaurs who are walking right now in front of us in front of me in front of you in the place you are sitting and if you think about it the size of dinosaur is like lic building no one had the chance of even actually even actually becoming something in front of that dinosaur so it's like oh, rajnikanth is there how do i become a hero something like that you know so the, when dinosaurs were roaming no one had a chance but the point is that how we came here we are ultimately here so something might have happened and what happened was that is the point uh, luck or evolution or god's will or whatever be the case there was some, there was an event so in class we will see that but the event and all i will tell you in class there was an event when this dinosaur vanished this dinosaur immediately or suddenly without any trace they vanished Okay, now we have those trace as fossils. You will be uh, seeing so many, or you would have seen this Jurassic Park movie. So once they vanished, after that came the evolution part of human beings, and that is what we will study. And what we will study is that we came as a small tree shrew. See, this is our ancestor. This is our great great grandfather or grandmother. Okay, great, 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 great grandmother. So this is how we lit, looked in seventy million years ago, and uh, what happened was uh, th this is tree shrew. Okay, it is like a tiny rabbit or tiny uh, rat or something like that. And that is why that is why in class I'll tell you that is why we make so many experiments on rat. We are so much related. Then came this fellow or this person, this ancestor, lemurs, uh, and then uh, this. small fellow uh, tarsier so slowly slowly if you think about it the size keeps increasing the images keep define well getting it is getting defined as humans you look at your picture and also the picture that i am showing in the screen it is actually getting a little similar you know and then came this uh, new world monkey and then uh, old world monkey so uh, hanuma so religion that is the point religion also comes uh, down here so then old world monkey they say and then comes something called as gibbon <clears throat> then comes a little uh, later called as orangutan and then comes a little later called as uh, uh, this uh, 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 what is that uh, gorilla and uh, the image last image should be last but anyways then comes gorilla then comes chimpanzee then comes the human being and this is what this story you know this is a story this is a story that uh, i am going to weave and i am going to tell you how this came about this is the this is the portion that we are going to cover in this part if you look at this now come to this part so this story you know the story which i have said that is what we will study in anthropology and that is what comes from for example look at this 1.4 So one point four to one point five. Look at this whole thing. Okay, wow. this whole thing, human evolution, this theories, the characteristics, all these things are beautiful. See uh, whether they are important for examination or not. We we will study. See there there is no point in skipping. This will not come in examination. That will not. We have to understand. Okay, wow. first how we came here. That is the point. So when we know that. you will understand that this and all are important so then what you have to study is that then uh, the, the point is that as humans came see this also so after chimpanzee how humans came this whole thing this 1.6 okay 1.6 how we humans came there is a huge uh, chronology of uh, evolution which happened australopithecus homo erectus Uh, that is everything. So Homo erectus, Neanderthal man, Rhodesian man, Homo sapiens. Homo sapiens is us. 
so how did we come here and that is what we will uh, learn through all these things but uh, one more thing see that is the point one more thing is that we are not only going to uh, learn in a sense how uh, we have come in what way we have come see uh, what you should learn in anthropology or in this syllabus you will be learning is that not only how we came here the process what has happened the process is that this we have come okay this we have come this is us okay actually see it is a little misogynistic also i should have kept a picture of a women also but uh, see last minute i prepared so please sorry okay so women or man how we came that is homo sapiens that is what homo sapiens means how we came how our skull see this is the this is what we will study how our skull first our head to transform how our then our spine for a bureaucrat if you think about it the first quality okay the first quality required for an ias officer is a strong spine you should be able to stand erect and say this is your opinion that is called integrity that is that we will study how it got strengthened what is the difference between other animals and humans why in humans this walking upright with your head uh, or with your head even if you lose okay even if you lose even if so many people say you are going to fail we walk with our head held high why why is this spine straight you know that is very necessary that we will study and then the most important and then uh, then the most important part is pelvis that is uh, uh, the hip part why it is very important why it is important for childbirth why it is important for walking so we may think we may take so many things for granted one slip you know one slip and one bone gets a little damaged we will not be able to walk okay we take so many things for granted you know and uh, anyways we'll still we, that is what in anthropology not only the subject you will understand what, the, what is the meaning of all these things that we are doing and then uh, this hand of course this is very very important so otherwise you see i i cannot hold this pen and all how did this hand get transformed so we are not only going to see this came that came that this came no how has this a uh, biomechanics in your body so many things are there it is biomechanics your body is like a machine they say how these biomechanics transformed into a thinking human and the next see that is the point so this is this is the point that we are going to see in the syllabus that i have talked about where we will be talking about how we came so and uh, one more thing is that see next thing we have to study all these things a 1.8 that is uh, how we developed so once i we have come as a human we are not just naked human you know uh, we have developed into something like how we live together we marry together we marry each other and many other things are there so how all these things came how this uh, agriculture came how this invention of agriculture came how this invention of urban areas came how this invention of cities came so one one thing all these thing all these things are one one thing it is a chronological basis of understanding of how we have ultimately come to a place where dinosaurs were evolving we have taken that place and we are now having class zoom classes you know so how did we do that that is we, that is very important thing that we are going to see and this is what is the first part so this is the first part this is the most important part see this is called as the biological anthropology this is the most important part whatever i have said now is biological anthropology and it is very important for examination also so in this class it is not only going to be only this is uh, this uh, topics and this how examination uh, we have to clear that is very very crucial uh it is no see no point in geez, we have come to civil services there is no point in just sitting and reading and going how do we clear that should be very prominent you know so we have to know the allocation of marks for each topics and how do we prepare for that so nearly 80 marks okay in paper 1 in paper 1 in paper 1 just a moment okay in paper 1 nearly uh, one uh, uh, is clear than audio is clear only right 
Okay. Uh, so in paper one, nearly 80 to 90 marks. So from this only, now whatever I have discussed, you know, it will be interesting. See how it is a, uh, how we came here. The answer, if you have, see how many will know the answer. For example, many would be sleeping only at in the morning, night. You will not be able to sleep. One person, I am also like that only. Uh, I don't like to sleep. I don't like to study in the morning. I used to study in the night. There is a reason. Okay, there is a reason for that. Why we have we are this nocturnal creatures. You know, many things we will learn. Why we are more attracted towards the sight. That see, in a sense, human beings are something which who are attracted through uh, seeing only. Why is that? There is a reason for that. And why is that? So we are so much fond of tea, coffee. See, all these reasons, biological, all these are biological. We think that all these, uh, it is a given we think. No, there is a reason for that. Why? How this evolution? Why you are the way you are? So this we will see. The next question. So this is about Brahma. So why we came, came here? So, that, so first question, we have to ask Brahma, why we came here? Here. So that is the God of birth. That is the phil phil first philosophical question some might, uh, somebody might have asked uh, somebody up there in the sky. The second question they would have asked is how to sustain my life? So next question that they would have asked obviously is how do I sustain my life? This is Vishnu. First is Brahma, second is Vishnu. This question, everyone, see, that is why Vishnu, the god Vishnu, uh, in India, if you think about it, he is a very prominent god. Why? Because he tells you how to live. This question, no one can answer, you know, how to live. So, there are, that is why so many self-help books are selling millions of copies. They are making millions of uh, millions and millions of dollars because no one can even say, how do you live your life? That is a very traumatic thing, you know, and that we have, that we will study in anthropology. That we will study in anthropology how we have to live, and what uh, you have to live, or why, or uh, what and all things are necessary for living. So, if you think about it, just a moment. So, what and all. So, the first thing that you will study is family, you know. So, this Doni. So, I, I also like him as a very uh, very, <laughs> I really like him. So that is uh, one picture. So it is his family, you know. So uh, first thing, what you have to know is how to live means uh, you ask uh, Vishnu also, God Vishnu also, you ask any person, how do you live? The first thing they'll say is family. Next they'll say is friends. And this is also something which I really like. So uh, in my UPSC preparation, this friends, so they were like my friends. The second most important thing that uh, people will say that for living is Friendship or kinship. First thing is family. Second is kinship. Okay. Okay. Pardon my uh, spelling. So first uh, in the board gets a messed up. So kinship. The sec third important thing, <laughs> obviously. So if we have to have family, uh, we have to have economy. Okay. Uh, this uh, there there are so many actors. Yesterday also I saw a video of Simbu saying that what is money without money la money la nothing uh, but money is important without money we cannot live sustain our life you cannot sustain they have crores and crores of money in a sense they will say paper, money is just a paper but we have to earn it for living our life to keep our family safe to keep our friends safe we need that money and the next most important thing is the leader so if you have to have, so if you have to have a, a proper family, friends, money, make money, you should, your leader, your country's leader is most important or the country's political system is important. This is what will make you, that is why you are voting. That is what, or for example, your uh, article 326 right to vote, where does it come from? Article 326 is not polity. If you think about it, it's a deep biological necessity. It is something which you are forming part of a government means that is very, very important. That is important because we have to protect our family, friends, all these biological things, you know, all these things that are necessary as God Vishnu is saying. 
all these things are necessary for that we need a leader for that article 326 is very important and the most next next important is god all the gods not one god uh, so during the course of this class you will understand that i am not a firm believer in any religion but i believe in god okay i believe in god but uh, so if i make any statement against any god please i am very sorry but uh, in a sense what i am trying to say is that i also was so studying so you would have known this while studying upsc we are we have this so many question god real uh, see when when our results don't come god la gadeyadu so but the point is that very important god and the meaning of god the purpose of all these things very important that we will see that we have to see so all these things if you think about it if you ask vishnu he will say that all these things and one more thing is that i missed out this and that is because that you are hearing right now you are hearing me right now that is language very very important so how do you live your life means these key ingredients family kinship Uh, money leader and then god and the language that you speak and that is why we have this movement of uh, in, the, in, the, in the people in tamil nadu will know this or in karnataka it is now becoming a movement many other states or many other places the uh, the the desire to protect your language it's instinctive you know it's not like somebody see political it's different but it's an instant instinctive thing to protect your language because it forms a very important basis for the way or how you live or how you sustain your life everything is in that language and that is what is the second question and that is what is the second part of the syllabus that you will see so till now this is biological anthropology next we will see see this society culture see both same society culture marriage so first is marriage that is family marriage and family so what is this we will see each thing uh, what is this Uh, different different types of marriages are there uh, single so this you may be single you may be committed uh, you may you may have uh, multiple partners you may have different partners so many things are there you know so what is that why is that what is the biological basis of that in a sense it is not like uh, somebody chooses someone randomly no no one chooses that why they don't choose someone randomly animals do that why we are not instinctively even if we are instinctively attracted to somebody we don't choose that person why is that why do we choose our appropriate person what is that family what is that kinship why is that friends are more important what is that it is not like people say that you know friend friend in sutra see there is a meaning for that there is a meaning for being part of something part of social being you know you are human so at the time of corona you would have understood we even in even if we are inside the house we started playing ludo we started playing whatever online carrom chess we wanted that group formation we wanted to be part of a kinship friendship why what is that meaning even if today people say that this rajinikanth and all will say today relatives la vaana veli po The relatives formed a very important part of our evolution. Okay, whether we like it or not, they part. They were part of an evolution. We have to study about that. Why is that important? So we'll study that. And then this obviously economic organization. As I said, this 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 dialogue, money is a paper and all that. The last screen le nalar gong. Okay, wow. But it does not fit. Money is very very important. and i personally okay wow, i personally understood after 2019 when i went to ananagar when all my attempts got over and i went to i till then nano is there until then i was also like uh, rajnikanth the simbu and all dialogue now it's just a paper nga it's very important after 2019 when i stepped on to ananagar for uh, getting this opportunity for teaching Yes, yeah, so I when I asked for teaching and things like that, when my attempts went went away, I when everything went away, then I realized, oh, oh, money is very very significant part of life. That is very important. So that we have to learn. Next, you have to learn that is what this political. So look at this political organization. How do we come? See why? Uh, how or how this evolution came? That we will read. Next, religion. As I said. 
uh, the concepts of religion, God, what is the meaning, how it came, why it came, uh, what are the different types of religion, what is, what is the difference between Christianity, Islam, many other things. And languages here, seventh, see, look at this. So this is the part that we are going to see. Uh, this, this, this is the second question, you know. This is the second question that you have to address, which is called as uh, how to sustain life. And this will be around, so for example, next, so very important, this is called as cultural anthropology. This is second most important part in uh, anthropology syllabus. This is cultural anthropology. And nearly uh, around 60 to 70 marks, you can say roughly. See, I am making an average of uh, the marks only. I am not giving you directly this much it will come. This is not a 12 standard exam where I can say this is the important topic it will come. Uh, that we can make sure that, okay, we can read all that. But the UPAC is a kind of not a 12 standard exam. Okay. So this is 60 to 70 marks. The third, see, that is the point. Third, okay. Uh, third important god that we saw is god shiva okay and the why we are worshiping uh, so as important as vishnu if you think about it he is the god of death or the mechanism you know the mechanism mechanism that sustains life sustains life till death or what happens after death. So he is the God of that, you know. So God of death, God of all these things. What is what is the what is the meaning of that? Is that uh, the things that we are, you know, that we are uh, are uh, the mechanisms. See, this this is the point. The mechanism. So, see, first in our layer, death, so don't uh, think like that. Death is very, very important. If you understand death, you will understand life, okay? So, uh, we have to know, and it's a, one statement of Kamala Asan I really liked. I used to like Kamala Asan, but not now. But I really liked Kamala Asan for one statement. So, he said that only when you know where your sentence ends, Okay, only when you know, this is his statement, not my statement. Uh, only when you know where your sentence ends, this sentence will get only meaning after that. It's a very nice statement that he made. That is, he's saying, only when you know the end of all these things, you will know, you will, you will create meaning for your life. Otherwise, it, you will be just lying around, things like that. Now you want to be someone, you want to be someone, you want to be an IAS officer, you want to do good to the society, or you want to be an IPS officer, you want to make changes to the way family is, your friends are. Why? Because you want to have a meaning for that. And, and how do you continue that? See, it is not the end, you know. In Bhagavad Gita, you will have a, you will not, you will have a statement. In Bhagavad Gita, when Arjuna was, you know, Arjuna was uh, really troubled that everything is going to end. At that time, Lord Krishna says this statement. If you think that this is going to be the end, you are, you are making a very big mistake. You think that uh, the, in a sense, whatever was, uh, whatever was before this point, whatever is in this point, whatever is going to be next, it is all me. That is what he will say. It is all me. That means what he is saying, you know, he is saying or he is talking about something called as DNA or deoxyribonucleic acid or in simple terms, it is called as gene. So the third part you will be studying here is that Everyone has to end. But what Lord Krishna is saying or what philosophy says that this is not the end. You know, you are not the end. Okay, or it will not be the end. You are the you are the evil. That is what that is what is science also is saying. You are the product of 4.5 billion years of evolution. That in class, I will tell you how, but simple terms. How do you sustain yourself? Okay, you are not going to end. You will be sustaining yourself through something called as genetics. Gene. 
and that forms the third important question third important part of this whole syllabus which is called as genetics see look at this human genetics this is more this is uh, see uh, not in a sense syllabus wise or uh, syllabus wise or question wise it is little see first two are very important okay first two are very important it is around uh, 40 little less important but more important in the case of how you sustain yourself but uh, as i said uh, uh, lord shiva is the god of death you know so this gene is very important but also very important are some many constituents are there in your body uh, many constituents which are very very necessary for you uh, to be uh, sustainable or proper in your life or uh, you know in a sense you, you have to push your death away for that you are so you would have known this blood group you you should know this the blood group uh, uh, your red blood cells uh, and many other things so many things all these things which are there in your blood so lord shiva will tell you what will happen after the death but you have to push your death away for that you have to keep yourself healthy blood and one more very important thing is vitamin okay the importance of vitamin i did not realize till few months ago and now i am realizing the importance of all these vitamins this chapter i used to skip while reading everyone knows all these vitamin story i'll uh, I mean, I, I was saying about while reading, okay, wow. while reading for examination, ah, vitamin A, vitamin B, everything, everyone knows. But these small ingredients, small, that's Life, don't ever think that this is small. Every small, even a small thing is very important in life. And that is what Lord Shiva teaches you, you know. Before death, everything you should know. And uh, that is the second and the, and the other part of the syllabus. And that is the syllabus here. Now look at this point. So e here, this age, sex, population, everything. See, uh, a blood group, uh, everything. This is, uh, uh, we will we'll, uh, discuss each of the things. Your fat level, pulse rate, respiratory function, uh, what uh, you, you, blood glucose level, everything. Okay? And uh, this is vitamin, epidemiological anthropology. So this is health and disease. Very simple. This is this is about this uh, different kinds of vitamins and what deficiency comes and things like that. Okay. And the next. So this is what uh, these three gods have given. Okay. Well, these three gods have given all these things. But the syllabus does not end. So three questions. But the syllabus does not end there uh, because these three gods are there. But uh, human beings are one more god. Okay. Well, human beings are one more god. And we have invented something called as race. Actually, those three gods have invented all the, so they have given all the answers, how to live, why to live, the things that happens after the death, genetics, everything. But uh, humans are not that easy. Okay? We have invented something called as race. And that is a very important chapter. So look at this. And we invented race based on some, a concept called as adaptation. We'll discuss in class all these things in class now. Yeah, how we got adapted to something. So why somebody is uh, so? It was a very traumatic experience for me in school when I was a when I was a, a, a small kid in school. Uh, I I studied in Kendra Vidyalaya. Kendra Vidyalaya. I went. I do not know. Kendra Vidyalaya. All were fair. Yeah, I was the only person like dark person. They were like they, you know, every day fair and lovely, but nothing changed. But at that time, I did not realize. At that time, I did not know all these things that uh, this Trisha, uh, this Trisha or Fair and Lovely advertisement and all, all fraud, but all, you know, it's not working or it will not work. Why you study here? See here. Biologic, very important chapter. Definitely some 20 marks. So uh, you can add up. So add up all that. So very important chapter, this and this, that is a point. We have discovered something based on our adaptation also. So look at this. 
so these two things 9.5 and 9.7 very key chapters okay key chapters uh, in uh, so if you add up this so uh, here this is very important so racism and race chapter nearly around 40 something so uh, if you think about it some two more chapters are left two more chapters are left and those chapters are very very interesting in a sense forensic anthropology will be there or applications of anthropology see whatever we have studied you know whatever we have studied the knowledge so tomorrow you become an ips officer tomorrow you become an ips officer uh, you have to uh, investigate you know you have to investigate death or see it happens or some something else some crime might have happened how do you investigate that if you uh, watched this please you can watch that also sudal uh, so well, uh, there is uh, one uh, nice thing in the, I saw that uh, few uh, it's a series in uh, Amazon. See, in class, I will tell you this also, okay? Or what to watch, uh, that also I will tell you. Uh, so well, you can see that. See, how do, how do you investigate? That is the point. How do you investigate? How do you investigate crimes? Okay? That, that you have to know, you know. As an officer, how do you investigate that Steps I will tell you, but that comes in application of anthropology. How do you investigate? How do you find crimes? How, uh, in a sense, how in uh, paternity cases? See, how do you find the father? So somebody is there. How do you find the father? There are so many uh, ethical issues involved here. So how do you find that? That you will see in, that you will see in here. See, look at this, applications of anthropology. So this is paper one. And one more thing, growth and development, it's a very simple chapter. And this is the story that I wanted to say. This is about paper one. So this is paper one. And paper two, I'll tell you, it's very, very simple. This is paper one, 250 marks. <clears throat> And paper two, I will tell you uh, very frankly, uh, in a sense, you can finish that, finish that in, uh, I do not know, uh, you can easily finish that. Three concepts, one caste, two village, three religion. These three things are then four is scheduled tribes. Yeah. So all the things in simple terms we, we can learn. Very simple. Uh, uh, basically, you can finish off this chapter if, in a sense. Geography option. La, so for example, geography option. Second paper. There will be uh, 10 chapters. In that two chapters is this whole syllabus. Okay. Religion. What is caste? What is village? Uh, way <laughs> you will understand when we are talking uh, in the class. You will understand uh, this uh, syllabus. You can also check that also. I'll I'll show you. Okay. And one more thing I forgot. Okay. One more thing I forgot. Very important thing. Our thinkers. Now I told you all the story. You know how life came. What uh, everything I said. But. Uh, same way I have said to you, there have been people before this. Okay, well, same way I have told you this, there have been people before this who have talked about how all this came about. And this is anthropological thinkers. Okay, well, all this we will see, classical evolution, historical, functional, cultural, everything. See, not the thinker Allah, Chuma, I, I will not uh, in, the, in the fast forward but need the uh, notes live. See, notes I will give. But uh, what those thinkers are thinking? Why those people are thinking like that? Only then we will understand, you know, that we will read. But this is paper one. But uh, uh, please note that also. I forgot to mention that. That was there. That is important. Okay? That is important as well. And the paper two is it's here, caste system, 
திஸ் வர்ணா சிஸ்டம் ட்ரெடிஷனல் எவ்ரி திங் சி ஆல் திஸ் சி இதுக்கு பாருங்க இந்த சென்ஸ் கர்மா இதெல்லாம் இருக்கும் கர்மா ரீனா வெரி இந்த லைக் இந்த வாட்ஸ் அப் ஃபார்வர்ட் தான் what is karma what is rebirth 10 10 marks all this i am not joking all this are marks okay va and uh, you will see village look at this you will see what is village what is tribal india what are the problems so village tribes caste and then religion so look at this and religion if you think about it so if you think about it look at this all this you know in the second paper the second paper if you look watch closely if you watch closely i'll tell you this fact okay you you please check this syllabus uh, and this syllabus i'll i'll mark those syllabus okay see look at this regionalism communalism ethnic and political movements okay role of in, mark if you think you see all this the things which i am marking tribal areas all this so the things which i am underlining see in class i can give you in detail this is just a demo i can just tell you the things that i am marking you know see this and all the problems of scheduled cash and scheduled tribe uh, this welfare measures all this see this page whole itself you can take this page this page this one you can take this one also and then this uh, till here till here from 2 3.1 3.2 four uh, sorry 5 6 7 8 all the constant you sit and read okay was sit and read not not the book you sit and watch the syllabus all the syllabus are nothing but your gs paper 1 social issues all the things that i have defined okay va in gs paper 1 social issues they would have given in simple terms they would have given regionalism you check syllabus you check the syllabus of uh, gs paper on regionalism communalism okay ma they would have given you women's issue or they would have given you vulnerable section vulnerable section this is in paper gs paper 2 and 3 you check the syllabus okay ma gs paper 1 2 and 3 so regionalism this this all this word is in syllabus in your gs syllabus regionalism communalism women uh, women and women uh, women's issue vulnerable section weaker section protection inclusive growth all this is there you please check this all this if you uh, if you uh, please watch that all this is what i showed you in and there is something called as culture okay in gs paper 1 culture in culture there are many facets okay see in culture i cannot gs paper 1 la there are many facets in that one facet is religion one more facet is caste in culture gs paper 1 they ask seven subset yeah that is gs paper 1 syllabus but i am saying in that seven subsets are there in that two subsets are religion and caste if you see if you watch, this is what paper 2 so when you read this holistically you will be able to attend your essay paper also so the first paper as i told you the first paper is uh, in a sense see look at this first paper gives you all this meaning okay first paper how we came how to sustain life what is life what is what is after death uh, and the interesting aspect of how to prevent death okay how do you prevent death 
you eat no that is the point see we are like a body which is walking so osho if you are fond of listening to um, these uh, god men no they would say this only right we are just a body we are walking in the ground we are walking in the world inge endu porandhu ipdi vandhom how do we maintain that see inge endu ipdi ivlo dhoram so from here to here we are going how do you sustain how do you maintain that things we eat you know things we eat from that so uh, that is what osho osho solvaru many other god men god men will be like this nam nithyananda solvaru so all are what they are saying we are just we are just a transient organism in this whole world we were born we are going to die in between we are living why to worry yeah that also that same thing i will also tell you we are born we are there going there before that you should become an ias officer or an ips officer or whatever you are dreaming to be uh, and uh, i hope this i made uh, i made it clear and this is a book okay so i before finishing that i will give you the book list also so this is the book list uh, you can take it down <clears throat> okay you can take it down uh, in this this book please you can get it okay this book you should get it biological sorry or physical anthropology p nath you should get it okay and one more thing i will ask you it is a little costly okay uh ah lokesh see uh, in a sense you you can direct the message lokesh you can put that message from the group also because in this message i will be only see uh you just call because the others also should see uh so lokesh is asked so one uh, question is that uh, i am from engineering background uh, so uh, how do i uh, understand this physical anthropology okay lokesh i, I am on first slide le i told you engineering electronics and communication okay wow. the point is that the things that you uh, one 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 statement i will tell you okay wow. the things that you fear the most will actually be the most interesting part of your life okay that is for life same way the things that you are fearing no physical anthropology eppadi the evolution la how to study this will be the most interesting part of anthropology i'll tell you okay when we are reading understanding and the understanding la see na vandu summa i will not say paarenga ipdi vanduche அது ஒரு மீனிங் இருக்கு கான்டெக்ஸ்ட் இருக்கு ஸ்டோரி இருக்கு வித் தட் ஓன்லி ஐ வில் சே வித் தட் இஃப் யூ ரீட் யூ வில் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் ஓ திஸ் இஸ் ஹவு வி கேம் ஓகே தென் யூ வில் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் த மீனிங் ஆஃப் ஆல் திஸ் அண்ட் தென் யூ வில் ஸ்டார்ட் லைக்கிங் இட் ஓகே தட் இஸ் தி मोस्ट இன்ட்ரஸ்டிங் பார்ட் லோகேஷ் சரியா சோ இன் ஆந்த்ரோபாலஜி அதுக்கு தான் சி அது தான் சொல்ற அந்த சல்மான் கானோட வி ஹேவ் சீன் இந்தியில சொல்வார் டர்கே ஆகே ஜீத் ஹே அப்படினா Uh, your success lies or success lies after your fears so if you are fearing af- uh, physical anthropology your success probably lies in front of you okay adu daandi poidunga kadachirum okay any other doubt so this you please take it out second point is a little costly see in the group i have shared the pdf in the group la or uh, the group that we have created i have shared the pdf this ember and ember okay wow. it is a little costly but ana what i would suggest please vaangidunga okay wow. uh, you please get it okay wow. anyone who is writing thank you prashant okay thank you uh, anyone who is wanting this uh, anthropology option uh, see 1000 rupees oh eight see, if you are not able to offer uh, i i have sent the pdf you take the pdf okay wow. i have sent the pdf you are not able to afford na vanda but if you are a person who can afford this get this book you are now upsc has gone a little ahead upsc has not gotten tough upsc is an examination same as the case with evolution that we keep talking about you know it is an evolving exam namma ore edathula if we sit in say, one place and we think that upsc uh, same things you ask upsc will not do that same is the case with gs same is the case with prelims upsc every day people think that they are a upsc is an unpredictable exam yes 
four five months four five months see uh, and uh, the book cover panting la kalai rasan i will talk about that uh, kalai rasan i will talk about the time period on the now but first book mattu copy panidunga uh, physical anthropology others also other doubts also you please put it down uh, static and dynamic okay uh, i'll tell you this say book please uh, you put the all the question okay but i'll tell you the book third book this uh, boss way this is simplified <coughs> anthropology is simplified this book please get it okay he is an ias officer i think he is an ias officer uh, the book that he has published is his notes uh, good notes okay you take that this physical the other things i will tell you okay well, this uh, anthropological thought in class i will tell you uh, but i want you to buy now if you are a person starting anthropology right now and you are enrolling for the batch na i want you to get this i want you to get this or otherwise pdf is there and i want you to get uh, this okay this three things very important second paper uh, these are the books eh? you can note down the books uh, uh, and uh, but uh, in class i will tell you in detail okay uh, this indian anthropology this tribal india uh, this is in pdf second paper very very simplified the same book you can take it down uh, this one book and two book that's it Yeah, you second paper is very less nga yeah? so now i'll uh, i'll address the question so first i'll address kalayarasan okay uh, kalayarasan five, four to five months syllabus ah syllabus taking time yeah okay, wow. time for syllabus see total books if you uh, if you analyze total books okay wow. total books eh, total books if you think about it first paper la i think 3 uh, okay 3 or 4 second paper uh, there is not much maybe one or two book or that basve book is enough okay one or two book or that basve book is enough so if you think about it the books are at the minimum possible number you know see veru notes not the, the point is that people think that uh, notes is very much useful nowadays or uh, that is how upsc has changed you know uh, people are thinking that with the notes we can clear this exam see more than notes uh, the general books uh, the pnat which i said the ember and ember which i said uh, basve okay uh, second paper with that you can clear this exam very well and if you think about it the minimum number of books is there so four months but four months can, uh, in a sense you have to uh, come through the class okay you have to come through the class four months five months avad four months okay four months kalayarasan okay va four uh, five months avad <coughs> if you are if you are continuous regular five months avad uh how much static and the dynamic ninety five percent static five percent dynamic see in u p a c understand this very clearly u p a c is an exam uh in a sense this option and all all core areas they are going to ask what is uh, homo erectus or what is see in a sense they might not even think about uh, what is happening right now why because we are studying millions and year, millions and years of evolution we are as i told you as osho said we are just in 100 years now nothing is going to change in this uh, 5% which i am telling that is paper 2 okay va the paper 2 la da or sila one some topics are there where we have to be a little dynamic but 
rest of the portion millions of years of evolution same yeah if you are strengthened that you will be able to uh, write this exam any other doubt any other doubt you want to ask uh plan of classes i have told you right in the in that in that i told uh, saturday sunday class saturday sunday class 11 to 130 okay one uh, that's it this is the this is a this is notes yes notes i will give you see for each topic uh, <coughs> in uh, in uh, uh, just a minute I, okay thank you anish thank you uh, i'll address mamta's question uh, notes yes for each topic see how i will uh, i'll do you know see prithvi uh, okay prithvi raj i will come to that uh, first i will address this notes okay wow. how uh, i will teach okay well, how i i propose to teach is that uh, with that i will address the uh, answer writing part also i think uh, akshay has asked so i'll uh, address the answer writing part, part also uh, notes and answer writing okay well, how i usually teach is that first i will go to that syllabus okay well, i'll tell you this is the syllabus that we are covering then i will tell you the background or what is see what is missing in peanut i will tell you because see when i am telling you a story of 65 millions of years of evolution i should tell you why this this dinosaurs disappeared when dinosaurs disappeared what was the impact which it created i have to tell you a small story i have to tell you for example Uh, when himalayas were rising why human evolution see in book it will be there human evolution is there but i have to tell you a little story of when the himalayas were rising you know what the himalayas which is standing right in front of us sorry in the north of our country uh, like a barrier protecting us from the cold waves in geography it will be there from the cold waves of china and the impact of china in our country where the reason for evolution of humans if i tell you that if i tell you that will you be able to believe those mountains that you are seeing when they arose those were the instinctive points which created human evolution that is you and me so i have to tell you this small background and in the syllabus it is given as australopithecus so this is australopithecus uh, this are the this are the features this are the see not like that so first i will go to the syllabus i'll tell you australopithecus means i'll tell you a little bit of background how it uh, evolved and then i will go to that uh, or i'll give you that topic i will give you the topic and the features characters which are necessary and given in the book okay this is what i will give you next what i will do each week okay well, each week so by this see by this point what i am trying to say is that in the syllabus what and all topic 1 2 3 4 everything is there we will be covering sequentially one by one one by one one by one according to the evolutionary pattern okay well, not randomly there is a link i will tell you okay in the class i will tell you do not worry all the link i will tell you all the integrated things i will tell you okay well. so uh, i'll lokesh i'll come to that point so first i'll finish this akshaya's point so uh, mamta i think you have understood la syllabus will be there i'll give you a background then the topic uh, we are going to discuss from the topic you can note down the points which are necessary and by the end of the week we will be completing a substantial amount of portion which is very important and i will give you a question one or two question i will ask you to write that question every week simple ah okay va and that question by that question we will be discussing the framework of answer writing every week okay va every week we will discuss 
but ana but ana we'll once the chapter gets over i'll give you a bigger test also but this will be enough so akshay is it okay so answer writing one more abbe completion and we will be completing together so analyzing this together okay okay so uh, lokesh's question sir uh, prithviraj uh, uh, prithviraj both paper taken in an integrate see prithviraj first paper important okay uh, first paper is very very important and as i told you that is the static part very sure or no you have to be very sure about this this is paper 1 once we finish that i'll tell you how it is connected to paper 2 how we are going to study that paper 2 how we have to link it to the topics uh, for example there is religion anga buddhism jainism uh, many things are there here we will be studying every really or religion in detail what is religion we will be studying but there we will be studying india specific so how uh, we are linking we will study that okay uh, uh see lokesh anthropology or sociology see uh, you should know that i uh, i i <laughs> i uh, my own thing was see i'll tell you this i am not an institute okay i am not an institute so i will not tell it uh, is only important that is important no uh, i wrote this exam eight mains i wrote okay uh, what i learned from this is that <laughs> you should not tell uh, or you should not be like biased towards uh, one thing which i or there is one question in, uh, in the interview la i'll tell you this question okay uh, in one of my interview in one of my interview Uh, the chairman asked me the chairman asked me see i'll tell you a question uh, you tell me how you will respond this is what the chairman said i said okay you tell me the tell me the point he said you are coming for an interview you are sitting in that interview and in that interview you note that there is a relative sitting or your relative or someone you know is sitting in that interview okay the, 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 that person is going to interview you how would you react that is what he the chairman asked dk dawan so now i don't think he is there uh, dk dawan he is vice admiral so this is the question so he asked me how you would re react see i should not uh, see i should not say right i know this person okay well, i should not say that i said that person itself okay well, that person itself should inform the chairman that person should inform the chairman that uh, i know this guy i know this guy and hence i will not ask questions so that will be the ethical point of a uh, examiner and i also should not uh, in a sense it should not be like sir i know you sir see i also i told that this is the both angle i told so in this case which you are asking anthropology is a subject which i am handling okay i should not be like you it is your life okay it is your life i should not be like parpa anthropology is a super adala illa what you like you please take and uh, that does not see adha da solran that does not mean that uh, uh, anything wrong and all so you are liking your choice life is about free will being a good choice okay any other doubt you want any other doubts uh 4 months yes raja yes 4 months is enough see 4 uh, months i'll tell you okay so we do we do see and uh, story all na apura thank you thank you so i i thought story see 4 months enough like this story raja the story and all class la solla nancha okay uh, but anyways i completed uh, this uh, whole anthropology syllabus you know um i didn't know, i tell you this i'll tell you this fact and maybe we'll close after that uh, i uh, i chose anthropology at one of my worst times okay i chose anthropology because i was 29 and i was going to be 30 okay i was going to be 30 and it was my fifth some fifth or fifth mains or something like that see i was getting old the turning 30 we'll we'll see that also why turning 30 is that i like abbe kaila shake aho 
okay why this shaking and all happens and why this uh, all this uh, buddha jaina uh, if you think about it the christ uh, muhammad uh, prophet muhammad all would go for some search of uh, truth in 30 da so 30 is a very traumatic age so when i turned 30 also it was a very traumatic event for me personally and i was writing mains okay and uh, in a sense i chose anthropology then only i understood that this exam is about knowing what you like okay and reading very well not chumma reading this and all this this portion this important reading very clearly and for that you should like that subject okay so for choosing option before that i had chosen many many wrong options uh, many uh, i mean i do not know uh, geography uh, public administration no see uh, i should not say wrong option ayyo for me okay well, for me personally uh, i have told this already uh, if you have seen kadalil sodapuvadu epdi paathireengala raja adha adha idala class la solla nanda kada okay well, kadalil sodapuvadu epdi vande and the director vande enoda friend okay well, uh, so optional sodapuvadu epdi i did that okay well, how to mess up options i did that but uh, when i was turning at this moment you know when i was turning at this moment okay wow. so when i was turning 30 um i wanted something to like okay wow. i wanted something to you know really like and uh, uh paathingala da okay so i in the 30 la i wanted to like something something which drives me something which makes me persever and uh, achieve the goal that i am uh, having that time i chose anthro and uh, really i did not have time okay well, i did not have time at that time uh, i was in a very lot of hurry at that time and in anthro i finished and i scored the maximum uh, on the on the year la i scored the maximum in uh, on that year now okay well, so 5 months i hardly 5 i do not know 5 4 months now and <laughs> secret la veliya solla koodadu but ama solran vechukoma paper 2 okay va paper 2 meliya solladinga don't tell to anyone uh, or uh, don't discuss this i studied for 3 days okay va i scored 140 oh, sorry 145 i think 145 second paper second paper okay 145 that actually helped me get through interview that time okay va raja Uh, you don't have to see uh, prithviraj you don't have to refer uh, i will tell you this see you don't have to refer i will tell you that how do you see what you, if you keep referring time will waste away for that only i will tell you the portions no i will tell you what is the meaning of all those topics no i will tell you only then you will go to the syllabus or sorry topic only when i have explained you what is the significance of that topic we will go to that topic so what point in referring to any other book you refer uh, anthropology straight forward whatever book is there that will be enough akshay that time okay that time my score was 290 2016 okay score see uh, akshay one more thing see understand one more thing we are reading see we are studying anthropology okay va uh, if uh, 60 70 million years of evolution mark is not the mark is not a sign of intelligence we'll uh, we'll discuss that okay va uh, mark is not a sign of intelligence okay niveda okay can we complete in 5 months if we invest weekends alone so if you are provide weekly targets at the end of the class ah uh, see 5 uh, months niveda see Uh, you already and for uh, if you have already studied anthropology okay well, if you have already studied anthropology na it will be even better but ana not two days uh, at least weekly uh, some okay so weekly see <clears throat> seven days are there weekly if you are able to uh, two days class uh, two days class uh, so weekly if you spend uh, or 2 hours per day 
if you are able to spend 2 hours per day one topic okay one one topic uh, every day 2 hours that will be enough yeah if for people who have already read uh, niveda has already read it, okay wow. so for her if you think about it seven days are there two days class after the class it is very tiring so it will not be you will not be able to read other five days two hours per day if you read one topic that's enough okay wow. any any other doubt Any other doubt you want to ask? Thank you, Anish. Thank you. Thank you, Anish. Uh, so we'll close the class. Yeah, okay. So I'll uh, I'll mark this as an uh, thank you note. Uh, so thank you all for joining. See, that is what I said. I I also said, uh, in a sense, you guys have uh, see. Uh, uh, in a sense, uh, I'll I'll frankly tell. Okay. Uh, not very easy to uh, trust someone uh, who is sitting in online uh, and uh, taking classes and uh, taking classes so uh, see it's, it's i know i know for a fact okay, well, human mind does not allow that okay, human mind i know for a fact how much ever i say human mind does not allow the fact that with the, the whole structure you know the whole structure will uh, the on the brain on the will not even make you un make you think that this person is going to help us or something like that but you guys have gone beyond that and you have given me this trust okay well, you the on the brain how it works now i know okay, well, i know very well uh, choosing an institute is the most appropriate decision the brain has to take an institute would be the most appropriate decision a brain would take but you guys have gone against that and given me your trust. Trust me, by the end of this whole thing, anthropology, okay, well, I can assure you one thing. You will know anthropology. You will know how to write answers. You will know what is the topic. You will know how to clear anthropology optional. Okay, GS also, I'll tell you. See, time, how, how much time is there, I do not know. If time is there, I will tell you prelims also. I will tell you mains also. I will tell everything, yeah, whatever. But I'm not time, that's point. So, with this time, we will discuss anthropology. And I will give you this whole thing which I have read. And as uh, Lord Shiva, the Lord Shiva, next, okay, well, after death, okay, well, after death. So, Lord Shiva, my name is Shivaraj Rajendran. So, you know, point, after that was my point of end but that does not end there as lord krishna is saying it does not end there you guys will take it forward you guys will take whatever i've read you will take take it forward you will get the service you will become an officer thank you all for joining so we'll see in the class okay, more things in the class okay, more stories more uh, krishna stories ramayana stories all in class thank you all for joining